Hey, I'm here with Jamie. Hi. How long do you think we've been going out? Are you asking me? Yeah, I'm asking you. How long do you think we've been going out? Uh, almost four years. Almost four years. Let me tell you a little bit of something about you. I think I know you pretty well. Okay, that's one thing. And uh, another thing, uh, besides my love of magic, I like card games. Okay, I basically just I like cards. So I thought I'd combine the two, my love for you and my love for cards. Um, poker is generally played uh, in hands of five cards apiece. Like you would have five cards, I would have five cards, all right? I've gone ahead and I've picked out uh, ten cards, kind of at random. There's a couple pairs. Uh, there's some uh, some triplets, right? Like three pairs or uh, three cards to make a three of a kind. That's what I'm trying to say. So let me pull out ten cards here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have ten cards. You haven't seen these ten cards. No. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask you to make a, a poker hand. And in addition, also give me a poker hand, okay? And I'm going to bet, because I know you and I know how well you think, uh, I'm going to bet that you're going to give me a winning hand. And I'm going to let you make all the choices, Okay. So first, uh, I'll let you choose a whole card, okay? <laughs> now, this is completely up to you. You can choose... I don't choose... know how to play poker. Well, it's okay. That's okay. Uh, I just want you to choose one of these two cards, and we're going to flip these face up, okay? It's called a whole card. I'm going to get to see your card. You'll get to see mine, but you're going to make the choice. You can pick this, uh, uh, this one here, or you can pick this one. Your choice. <clears throat> Go ahead. Just touch it. This is your card, yeah. and you want to keep this. Or, you want to change your mind? No. You're going uh -huh. to keep this right here? Yeah. You've chosen the ace. You've given me the nine. Okay. Next card. I'm going to put two down. I just want you to choose which one you want. This is for you. This is going to be your card. That one. You, you want to keep this one? Yes. Okay. Do it again. Can I look at this? No, we're going to leave that down for a second. Okay. Choose a card. You're going to keep that one for yourself? Yes. Okay. There you go. I've messed up a little bit here. I think I gave you a choice to... You have two cards, so let me catch up real quick. All right? But it's okay, because I'm still going to let you... Look, I'm still going to let you choose what card. I'm not going to uh, indicate which one I want. I'm going to let you pick whatever card. You give either of those cards to me. Just put it on top of my nine. Either one. Face down. Make a choice. Face down. Face down, okay. All right, now let me catch up, and then we'll get back to dealing one at a time. So go ahead and put one of my, or, you know, put a card on, on my pile. Got it? Mm -hmm. Okay, get back one for you. Which one do you want? You want that one? Mm hmm Okay, you got to give me one. Okay, now there's two cards left, and just to make it, uh, fair and throw another variable in. I'm just gonna deal as normal where I would give one to you and one to me That's all there is mm -hmm. now Why don't we go ahead and flip your cards face up and see what you've dealt to yourself? Okay. You've given yourself two aces three three aces, aces? Wow is this and, how you and, this trick? and two nines mm -hmm. Do you know what they call that that hand in poker when you have three of a kind and two of a kind? It's called a full house the second highest poker hand. The only thing that can beat a full house in poker is a straight flush. That's where the cards are consecutive and they're all the same suit. It would look something like what you have, I'm sure. a nine of spade, a ten of spade, a jack of spade, a queen of spade, and a king of spades. Thanks for dealing. Love you.